Hello everyone, I'm Dustin Adventure. Welcome back to the Wizard of Legend. Wasn't intending to do another recording of this game today, but I, 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 I did a couple episodes earlier. Had a lot of fun with it. I had to do some stuff around the house. Uh, we came back. I'm like, oh, I need to do this. I need to do that. Let's do one more, one more play of Wizard of Legend. I have too much fun with this game. All right, so we unlocked a crazy combo maker last time. So we've got our cube. We've got this little ice bobber right here we can throw down, which creates all sorts of mana. But what we realized also is as soon as you get enough to use your signature blast, it refreshes the cooldown instantly. So if you want to do, you know, pop a Q, we're attacking, and then pop another Q, we can just have craziness go on. That's amazing. That is all sorts of amazing. We're also using the flame punch as a basic instead of a water. I like the water. I love the water. Oh my god, that looks like a railgun. Storecraft. Ooh. Ooh. But we're gonna give this a shot. Because that has a great AoE potential. Okay, we're starting off in fire. Earth guy got us last time. He's not gonna get us this time. I don't have an exact. I don't have a like major attack spell at this point. I'm noticing that. We took a little bit of damage. We got healed up. We're okay. Over here, punching. I have to get it up closer to use that that right click right now. Enhanced flame strike, hundred bucks. What does enhanced do for us on this? Uh, executes quicker, affects a larger area. That sounds amazing. Shatter strike is a earth skill, and an earth skill would be nice. Iron spike's not the best. Not the best lightning skill. I like it. I've used it. It's helped me out, but I, I don't like it in general. I think I believe we give you Arcana and you heal us. So if we had a spare Arcana, you'd be a lovely addition to the room. Okay. Dead end. New surprise. Shop down there, I believe. Back up this way. Oh man, that was screaming battle room in my mind. That's a battle room, right, y'all? Oh no! Ah, I think we get into more trouble falling into pits of lava and water and stuff than we do anything else. Okay, um, can I cast it over here? I can! Oh my gosh, that's awesome! Ok, 
Okay, we VAP for Arcana rewards. It reduces how much we do via Arcana. Fire would just be increased fire damage. Blasty Sprite does random stuns, which is really, really cool, actually. So if we get the money for that, I would take that in a heartbeat. Because uh, a, a free stun on an enemy every, you know, X amount of time is incredibly valuable. But also, don't forget, uh, we need to buy the investment to enhance our blasting strike. That's that's probably the better choice. In fact, I believe that was a hundred coins. Let's not forget about that. Okay, boss room. Check. Uh, it was, was it this one? No, it was the Arcana one, which is purple. There we go. Blasting Strike increased Flame Strike. Well, Blasting Strike, Flame Strike, same thing. 100 bucks enhanced. That means that we executes quicker and affects a larger. Oh, that 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 that's a big. That's a big area. Oof. It's awesome. 98%. Um, it's a little bit right here next to the relic shop. Might as well check it out. You never know what's there. Might be nothing. It might be a waste of time. It might be a battle. It's a battle. It could be gold. Or it could be a dead end with absolutely nothing. Well, at least we checked it out. Oh, I need to figure out what the mirror does. All right, go team. Seven, 84 HP, excuse me, 84 uh, Mabobbers, coins. Yeah, there's nothing we can actually buy here, so... Onwards and outwards. Uh, 36 enemies defeated, 900 points, play player one. So I can, I, I'm gonna ask uh, Dan Mason, one of our slackers, he picked this game up as well. I need to see if he wants to do a couple co-op things. I'm pretty sure it's co-op. It's either co-op or we're trying to kill each other while we play. I'm not sure how the player works in this game, but I would love to see it. That blast range is amazing. I really need to use that to my advantage more often. You guys came out of nowhere! Jerks. I got some healing, though. Do you buy relics? My gold now. No! No, I had that before. No. I opened it in a box and he automatically took it because it was on the ground. Because you drop stuff on the ground. Ow. That was a cursed item. It was, um. Uh, it increases fire damage, like, big time. But it, it, it excuse me, it increases fire damage. It makes all fire attacks burn. Uh, at the. You take double ice damage. Oh, uh, well. We got coins, I guess. Yarded. I would have actually taken that. That would have been great. Oh well, it is what it is. I didn't realize rel relics could actually come out of boxes like that, so uh, that's actually pretty amazing. Raspberry cookie box, permafrost cube. I feel like permafrost cube might be increased ice damage. Or maybe a chance to freeze with ice attacks. In which case, that would be amazing since we've got a 
pretty decent ice attack that we throw down at one. I mean, we can just go poop. I say poop, I mean poop. Increase ice damage to that or increase chance to freeze with that would be awesome. Um, I think it was like 125. Uh, enhanced flame damage. Not a big fan. Stalwart Defenders. I, I don't know what that is, but I'm intrigued. And earth damage would also be nice. Let's hang on to our money for now in case we run into a box or something that has, uh, like, need X, X Arcana types, X elements to unlock. I still haven't unlocked one of those. I don't know if they're like really special, if there's a relic box, you know, what's going on with those. Fire traps. Here while you do stuff, do things. Oh, I that's not what I thought it was. Hold up, I can attack you through walls. That sounds a little broken. in a battle. Took some damage. Not too keen on that. time around. We'll get lucky and find some more HP in pots. That is 100% a battle area. here we'll take it I see moving on up the world we have 241 gold holy moly gonna, thank you combos my friend the absolute savagery in the combos Where is my missing moment here? I don't see. I don't see any missing spots. Um, call me crazy? Is that right? I mean, uh, unless it's to the north, and that that area right here is not cleared out. Uh, I can give it a shot real quick, and then we just work from there. Say, so have I found my boss room yet? Oh, this was in fact the way. And there's my boss room. Problem solved. Okay, there's the guy who stole stuff from me. I talked to you. I mean, did you give me money for that? Okay, or just pay for appraisal. Interesting. Um, from a frost room, Q125. Still tempted. Uh, we could afford that and a heal at the same time. But over here, that's not what we want. Over at the red portal, purple portal, colorblind portal. We've got, yeah, so I mean, so, uh, Dollar Defense is not sure what it does. It sounds interesting. 
Let's take with what we know would be great. Possibly great, I should say. Let's grab the Permafrost Cube, which uh, at, at does add a chance to freeze foes. I don't know if that's off of every attack or only off of our eyes attacks. That could be fun. And then grab the healing pot just to make sure that we're A-OK -okay with this fight. reflects one projectile. Shield breaks after reflect and respawns on a timer. What? So it just blocks a project. That's amazing. Sweet. Well, we're going into the boss room. Um, with the HP we get going into the boss room, we're going to have a full heal. We're going to be setting at 500 HP. Plus, we have HP down here, which I don't know if we can leave after a boss battle, but we really should consider it next time. Alright. Flaming Brazil. Let's go. You warmed up yet? Cause I'm bringing the heat. Yo, we bring in the frost, lady. blocked one of those? Oh, oh. Yep, 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 craziness. Say hi to my friend. Okay, you gotta do some crazy thing. You're gonna get destroyed. Or not. I'm gonna get destroyed. Close enough. Yeah. Oh, we got something new. Gla we got. Oh, well, it's Glacial Cross. I like my stinky. I'm sorry. I can't leave out of here, can I? I can't. So that one HP is just going to have to be there forever. I'm sorry, HP. It is what it is. No gold. 20 gems. Took a little bit more damage than I wanted. But we are moving on to the second floor with Earth Guy, who also poisons. Found that out the hard way last time. I hate everything. So we 
we got? We have many things on sale, actually. Uh, Relic Rewards cards, so relics are on sale. Sinister Ledger, Resolute Sevalon. Uh, could take the potion, which would help us. I don't know what Resolute is, but I want to see what it does. Uh, increase resistance to fire-based attacks. That's good had we not already done the fire level, so... A little too much, a little too late. At least we're learning what these skills do, so I'm not too mad about it. Almost walked into that, that was bad. Yo, I didn't realize that did damage, jeez. Alright, we may need the money for the, oh, the potion soon! Makes me wonder, the uh, permafrost cube would be a really good cube to have going into the dungeon, since ice skills have a chance to freeze. In fact, I, I'm not even sure if it's just ice skills or just any skills have a chance to freeze. So many gems. Okay. No, you jerk! Knock you in there too. Okay, much in need of a potion. We just got wrecked in that room. Poison arrow user. Tanky, aren't you? So what's good against you guys then? I thought fire was good against plant. Uh, maybe not. Maybe fire is good against ice. Ice is good against plant. In that order. Seventy-two percent. There's some over. Uh, not quite here. Twelve. At least we have enough for a potion. That's what, like a hundred. Gosh. Okay, yeah, you know, we're only slightly hurting. Life is good. Everything's good now. Everything's 100% okay. We got Roxel's Pendulum, so uh, cooldowns were decreased. That's nice. Whoa! Rogue's hidden in the trees. What we got here? We've got a choice between a rock, uh, another rock, a basic, a basic, and a Cyclone Boomerang. I want the Cyclone Boomerang, I really do, but. I need healing. Healing is imperative at this point. Just drop a healing potion, 294. Might we get another 75 for that? Where are we shy at the moment? Uh, to the north of our blue exit. I can't go up from here, I gotta go around. The shop or battle room? It's a... Yeah, Volatile Gemstone, Aberrant Cologne, hmm, I know what the red button does, that's the one that, uh, we don't, we can't get healed until we go to a new floor. 
but also lowers our max HP to 300 starting, so... Mm, it would actually be a 6 HP increase, ironically. Uh, Aberrant Cologne, I don't know what that does, and nor do I know what Volatile Gemstone. The gemstone is, is volatile, and it's a gemstone, so let's go for it. <laughs> How bad we get an SO weld on here. Signature charge rate and decay are increased dramatically, but charge signature damage is reduced. Shell of the perfect time crystal. I wonder if we could... Volatile gemstone, I wonder if you can like restore it to the perfect time crystal. Maybe, or it's just a, a variation of it. So, signature charge rate and decay are increased dramatically, so... But the damage output on it, can we see how much the damage is? It doesn't say. Yeah. Alright. Alright, I'll see. I'll see what your your deal is, sir. There you go, let's go. Actually with uh with our, 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 uh, uh, AOE that we toss anywhere. Map the get. Ow. Got him. HP healed up to about 211, which isn't bad. What did we unlock here? Searing Chain, which I'm a fan of, honestly. We've got a VIP Arcana Rewards card, which means we can buy stuff at a discount. In fact, Arcana would be... Purple? Purple. 93. We could actually get an increased Searing Rush. Uh, get an explosion, I believe. Almost have enough for Cyclone Boomerang. In fact, I would like to take Cyclone Boomerang over the other one, but we would need three coins, and I think we've actually cleared out the, the, the map pretty well. Uh, mm. Let's save it and just get another potion on the next floor. 110 is enough for a potion. Finalizing pattern. Get ready. Oh, another cursed area. Double edged cestus. Golden armor of envy. I know this raises shop prices. Probably increases armor drastically, but yeah, we'll we'll we'll, we'll see after this. After this, after I find my potion, we'll take that. HP, we're getting a lot of mana crystals. I like seeing the mana crystals. Dude, we're kicking names and taking the butt. That's not the saying. You know what I mean. Nice. 
Really, I got hit by the stationary thing. Oh, you are the worst kind of person. You're not a person, you're a little totem thingy that shoots fire, so yeah, I can't really complain. Three Gorges Bulwark. Don't know, I feel like you might be ice protection. That increases HP per hits you take. HP is imperative, I think, at this point, and we have enough for an extra one. Um, I don't know what Raspberry Cookie Box does. And that's why I'm gonna take it. Health was drop. Oh my gosh, that's amazing! Yes. By that, let's go ahead and go over here and take armor envy, which should be increases armor, but store prices are increased. That's exactly what I thought it would be. Let's see, where are we? Uh, we take a right from here and go up. Quite been there yet. Store prices. Oh, 140 for perfect storm. <sighs> Had I known this was there, had I known, had I only known, we get lucky. Like do some gold drops. Nice. This is a challenge room, definitely. Die, all of them. Seventy-four. We're still. This, this is just destruction to the maximum. I love it. Now, if only we could actually see some HP drops. You know, for the item I said, HP drops drop more frequently. I. I've yet to actually see it. The little grass nodes are technically the, the new barrels. Alright. Oh, I can break the... I didn't realize I break the pictures. I hate you. 232. We didn't go down too much in HP, but it would have been nice if we could go down at all. I'm sitting at 111 coins and 140. <clears throat> Excuse me, I need like 140 for that. After I kill the boss, I should have enough for the enhanced storm. Like 140. If I can get 30 coins off the boss, I'm, I'm golden. Die, that is. Okay, we get down to boss form, we can take him down a little bit easier. Buddy. 
Got him. Please tell me you're dropping what I want in my life. 162. Also, we got the love of Midas, which means we're going to get more gold, which supersedes some of the other stuff I've done, stupidly. There's our perfect storm right there, which is awesome, because that means our storm is now enhanced, increases storm size and duration. Yo! That is... That is so much better than what it was. I'll take it. We're going for a boss fight now, and I don't know how we're going to do, honestly. Uh, considering we've got one AoE, we've got uh, several AoEs. We might have it, maybe. Maybe not. Uh, we'll see. 270 out of 500. Haven't bought him, haven't beat him yet, but I've only fought him once, so... Uh, just need to avoid his... Avoid his self and, uh, get going on him. Looks like we can... Oh, gosh. Oh, my gosh. Oh, oh. Okay. Don't. Okay, we got this. We got oh, maybe not. Oh, sh shoot. So he does a lot of attacks. And that's, uh, every time I've fought him so far, I keep running into him at the second, second phase. So... I did learn this, so the, the bosses aren't always set. If you fight a fire boss in the first level, then, you know, he has... Any boss you fight on the first floor, essentially, have much limited movesets and attack slower than what they do later on. So, fire boss has less skills, earth boss has less skills, water boss has less skills. Second floor, they have more stuff, they move faster, they attack harder, that kind of thing, and third, they're all crazy. So, it's gonna be having to learn new stuff. The, the second one's gotta take us a little bit of time. I'm not worried about this. Perfect Storm just seems way too powerful not to take. Okay, there's the tectonic drill that he was attacking me with. Blazing Blitz. And there's a Shattering Strike, a new ultimate. I kind I, I, I want to see the ultimates. I think the ultimates will stand out. We got a rock and roll, and then we got Shrek a boulder to shatter it in a ring of shrapnel. Okay. Let me open you again. That's that. Hmm. Could be fun. Earth attack, so it's not necessarily a bad thing. Uh, what's Blazing Blitz? What's oh, a side skill? Dash forward and pummel for the barrage of fiery punches. So it's only a dash attack until I actually hit somebody, maybe? Oh. Oh. Okay. That actually looks really cool. Uh, I wish I could do Perfect Storm still. Um, spark Laser, Spark Contact, it's a basic skill. Okay. Spark Laser, Jolt Foes with a Burst of Electricity, are you... Actually attacks really fast. And it uh, seems to be... So the final blast is more of an AoE. It's essentially the other, essentially is the fire blast kill, but a little bit more AoE centric. Hmm. So it's the only dash we have right now, and that's unfortunate. Still. Um. Let's see, shockwaves that buff foes in your path. I'm gonna try switching out the wind, just so we have a deep that wind standard. Let's go back with the. Where are you, Perfect Storm? Eh? There it is. And then, I don't know, should we use the Earth one? I kind of like the rock and roll. Uh, Snowflake Shackrams is amazing, and I do love it. Fire skill, 
Let's get your Arcana. We could use Glacial Cross, which is a fighting thing. Enhanced Fist explodes and fires off a cone of ice shards. Um, does it always do that if it's signature? It's only... It's not the enhanced one that we currently have active, is it? it no, it is. Hmm, so ice and it freezes almost definitely. Alright, let's give this a shot. Two ice skills. We don't have a fire, which feels weird. Maybe I should just switch to a fire skill. That way at least we have the gambit. Or Earth skill. Trigger a bolt of shatter and a ring of shrapnel. Creates additional shrapnel. Summons additional buzzsaw. You know, let's do rock and roll. Because rock and roll is this one, and it has a long distance. It holds people across. I didn't realize there was a place up here to buy things. Okay. We need to unlock those. So that's how you unlock those. You just go to the other sides of the stupid map. Let's go. Ooh, we get to start with that guy, so we get to see his earlier version, and maybe to, to, to familiarize ourselves with some of his attacks. Like fire. I don't have a relic for you. Oh, gosh. Every time. Every time. Oh, it's Q. Keep reading. That's my hat, it was R, so... I'm a little bit, uh, gun-shy. Switching out skills all the time, you, you... forget... what skills did what where. So I think this is just a cooler... less of a, uh, cooldown time on this. Wind. Which I'll take, that's nice to have. God, that messes you up, don't it? Talent, not sure what it does. Freezing Sprite Potion, uh, Amulet of Sundering does increase to all attacks. Like, no downside, not like a huge damage increase either, but you know, yeah, averaging across all attacks, it's not a bad thing. Expect those guys to start throwing, bolt, throwing boulders at us. Oh boy. Rock 
general in general is an amazing skill. It may just be poor decisions hampering my my attack this time. Okay, also, you're just a jerk. That doesn't go across the board. Yeah, I really don't have a range attack other than that, do I? Ooh. Searing sail, searing strike would actually work into this mess pretty well, honestly. Um, I may come back for you. Found the boss room? I think maybe it's over here. Go, okay, boss room found. Uh, let's see. I don't know why I went there. Obviously, that's the starting. We'll have to throw down an HP pot, because, yes. Um, I don't know what Phoenix Talent does. I could probably take a Arcana or something and, and have a. Uh, much better go at it, but I want to know what Phoenix Talent does, so I'm going to take it. Uh, adds a chance to burn foes. Ooh, okay. Oh, well, that's, that's a messed up time. You just attack so fast with that spark skill. I mean, yeah, you, you can take a lot of damage in an instant, but... Ooh, it's amazing. Right. Will we even make it to the boss? I don't know at this point. Seems like the earth area in, in a hole is just... Is, I'm not a fan of it. Okay, what is this? Tectonic Drill Enhanced. Enhance. Enhanced. Right. A bench, because uh, obviously people are walking around those chaos trials of doom. And like, you know what? I need to take a rest. I sit down, stretch my legs, relax. Got no worry here. output is insane. If we're taking my D and bringing it back for whatever reason. Gotcha. Alright. The chance to burn is actually actually really coming out right now. Get him. Also, because we're attacking so fast, it's actually coming, uh, it's actually working really well with our base relic, which is the Vampire's Eyeglasses, regenerate HP every time you land a crit hit. Add a chance to, okay. I didn't realize it adds a chance to mix it, miss attacks, that's, I didn't read that fine point, actually. Um, so we got Nox Heavenly Boots, um, you have a huge chance to evade an attack but if you take a hit, you take double damage, so let's not. Tortoise Shell probably gives us huge armor, but makes us slow as butts. Which, considering we have the Wind Dash attack, can't be that bad. Oh, no, we're, we're, we're not slow. Increases armor, but decreases damage. Oh, boy. Okay, well, decreases damage, increases armor. It means we're going to get more hits, and maybe... 
maybe this will cause us to get more crits, which in turn will mean we get more healing of our vampire. Maybe not. To see. Where are we doing? Uh, up and left. So let's go at left then. Damn, I thought that was going to be another battle room. That works. Oh, trap. Trapperoo. Trapperoo. Just get rid of you, 168. Oh, the poison damage. So poisoned? I think you don't take poison damage as long as you don't move. At least as much, I should say. Going down this way. Pop this, you never know. I was really hoping for HP heals. Uh, Relic Shop is looking more and more important. Fire Ranks is Hourglass. Uh, I think it's when you're low on low HP, it reduces their cooldowns drastically. Central Lizard, uh, as you kill enemies, uh, you gain damage, but you lose it if you take hits. And then we're not sure what Augur of Poetry and the quest tra crap, trap, crap, <laughs> clap trap does. I want to say it's probably a uh, movement speed increase. That's 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 what I'm going for. Designed by Artisan Ta Taco Bowls, this relic allows you to look quite dashing as you gallop to max speed with ease. Okay, bless bless you. Oh, you go into max speed very very quickly. Also, you have a horse head. You don't have a horse head, I have a horse head. I picked up a relic. I have a horse head. But I can go to max speed really fast, so... Upside. About that later. So never ever to find coins or anything of like that matter. Um, let's see, to the north it looks like. No, we've already gotten all the portals unlocked. We're still a couple of rooms shy. Well, okay. We were a room shy. Uh, did we take the healing potion already? I believe we did, yes. If we have any arcanas we can pick up for the price that we have, 125. Tectonic drill. Wouldn't mind it actually. Uh, toxic trap dash. Uh, 175, 175, 175, uh, after we kill this boss, we can probably pick up a new Arcana. So, let's get at it. That. I'm not sure what Augur of Poetry does. It may be amazing, it may not. Arcana, is there something we need from the Arcana room? Uh, Tectonic Dash, 200, almost. If we want to sell, maybe. Frost Fan, uh, we got a wind attack already. Technically, I don't know if it counts. Poison Trap, uh, it's a dash attack. Let's get Augur of Poetry just to learn what its effect is. It's half the game, right? Learn what things do. Increase resistance to earth-based attacks. That's actually fantastic, because we're about to fight an earth boss. Of course, we are heavily melee influenced right now, so if we're going to fight this guy, we're going to have to really watch ourselves. Oof. Alright, 
Alright, let's go. Fingers crossed. Bitch repairs have been terrible. So now it's time to get try crushed. Wow, we, we, we broke 60 hit combo. That's that's dumb. Ooh. Oh, they follow you. Must be his special attack, essentially. Man, we got him. Your will is stronger than diamond. Farewell, a rocky journey awaits you. Nice le exit. Hold up, and we got... This is the... That strike. I, I, rock and roll is just way too good with what we're doing right now, so let's go. Yeah, this is the first time we've left uh, with f going to the next area with full HP, other than when we had the curse that gave us so. So these two bosses are bosses we fought before. I haven't fought them on the second stage yet, so who knows what crazy their power is going to be at this point, but also we're not actually cursed yet, so... We, we are just the punching. Punching is crazy. We actually have HP on the floor we don't need. That's the first time. Forty-seven out of five hundred. another curse we could take if we want to take another curse do we want to I think we're actually doing really, really well if we get down the dumps and we're not sure if we can handle it let's pick up a curse it might give us the, the advantage we need what is down here relic shop relic shop Minus touch would be amazing. Also, permafrost cube. Chance to freeze on top of our chance to burn. I don't know if it actually stacks. That's the problem. I'm afraid to take it and then have it be like, oh, no, you have to put one down. Because then that's just wasted money. Uh, grease boots, this increase dash distance, I believe. Oh my gosh, we just lost so much. Thing. Oh my gosh. So we can't fall in if we just are on the edge and we're attacking. That's. I didn't know that. But that's good to know. Now. We managed to lose a lot of HP in that room. That's insane. And bad. That's the curse room. Not quite. Not quite what we're looking for. Amazing. 
Probably wouldn't hurt to go ahead and pick up her HP now. I can actually punch you. Kind of. Cannot punch you. No, we're just gonna cheese these guys. I, I don't. I can't take falling into the pit any more than I already have. Yeah, does not do anything. Plus, doing this, we're actually getting a slow bit of HP back. Every time we crits, we get one back. There we go. Free stuff. There's the boss room. I've just gotten, gotten mana gems out of them. I don't know if you can get HP gems. Which would be nice. We're at 92. What are we missing here? Uh, right over here to the upper right of blue map. That's a battle room. Ooh, yep, battle room. The battle room? Oh, we got Arcana Shop. Yes, I need that in my life. I don't know what you would do for me, but enhanced. What does it enhance for our contact? Final blow creates a shocking electric burst. Yeah. It always already was creating a shocking elastic electric burst. What's it mean? It actually shocks, in which case, yay. Um, I would get this, but we need to pick up the potion from the other shop. Get ready for a boss battle. Let's ready to rock and roll. You monster. Oh, I ran into you. How did I run into you? Oh, I can I actually just keep stunning you? Oh, I didn't use my. Q and R, like I said, the first time I had that skill, it was on my R button. I keep getting thinking, it's on my R button. Okay, uh. 
108 HP. <sighs> Maybe the last time we can fight anybody anywhere. I don't think we have enough money to spend on anything. Yeah, 100 bucks isn't enough to do anything. Most we can do is take a curse. Do we dare take a curse? I don't know what some of these things do. I'm gonna take it. I gotta learn. What's a tiny crocodile heart do? Reduces max health and increases max health for each enemy defeated. What? Well, that's horrible for a boss, but sounds amazing everywhere else. Alright, into the boss. 250. We still have. Oh, we're not going to the boss. That was stage one. <laughs> okay. Well, in that case, maybe we will be getting some benefit out of that curse. Actually, it's really at 260. Yo. This doesn't reset, does it? Because, honestly, this seems a little bit broken. We went up 30 HP in, in almost no time flat in one room. Like a heal, I believe if I give you an arcana, you heal me. Let's break your stuff though. Can't break that. Break that though. Bye. Back up to the cap already. Okay. Kind of messing us up a little bit. Three eighty. So there's. It does seem to be a cap that you gain per level at least. So that's 130 HP. That's uh, obscene. Oh my gosh, stop it, stop it, stop it, stop it, stop it. Well, now we know we're gonna have to buy a potion. Put a healing, hidden a healing in there. Tesla coil, probably increased lightning damage, which be a bad thing. Um, decreases cooldowns. I don't know if that would work for anything we got going right now. Surefire rocket, not sure what that does. I I'd imagine knockback. Let's take a Tesla coil. What do you do, Tesla coil? As a chance to shock foes. And it didn't drop. It didn't drop my um, my fire. So now we have a chance to shock and burn whenever we attack foes. That could be devastating. Because I think shock is actually a stun, isn't it? Attacking fast, that chance to do anything is an amazing thing at all. That doesn't make sense. You, you, you know what I mean. Drop me here. Heroic leap. 
Designed by Virtuoso Michael Beloy, this arcana allows you to seize a foe and leap high into the air before crashing down. Wait, so it's a, it's a grapple move? Might be good. Okay, here. Stop. Please stop. Oh gosh, that's, that's, that's for Dunk. Also, we're almost dead. Distance from these guys because I don't want to take dumb damage from slime. Let's see that other room over there. Um, yeah, let's head in here. It is up from there. Did we not actually go up from here? I don't think we did. I think we just went straight back down. Arcana. Perfect storm enhanced. Oh, 125. We can't take that and the heal. We gotta take the heal for now. 65 is just way too low to go into battle with. Depending on how much gold we get out of this battle, we'll see. that instant stun him? Oh my gosh, I think that instant stuns him with the combinations we have. That's uh, really, really, really good. We also get this, which increases our HP every time we take damage. So we're going to the boss battle, maybe not gonna happen, but it's worth it to try. Um, hmm. Uh, Roxas Pendulum or an increased Perfect Storm? We are fighting the Ice Guy. Uh, I think maybe increasing our Arcana is probably the best option to go with. Alright. Then we are... Oh, we're stepping to the break. Never know. Can HP increase about 50 points going into the next area, and uh, yeah, it'll be boss time for us. Have, we don't have any fire attacks, we have shock attacks, uh, and we'll see, 75. Much wider arena. We can move much faster than we could last boss. I think we're good, honestly. Oh, we did that though.
Keep running, keep running, keep running, keep running. Yay! Ready, leave. Wow! <laughs> Devastating. Frost Queen Freya, we gotcha. We gotcha. And I have no need or want this, because it's new signature and the, what we're doing with the combo and the melee and stuff is just, it's brilliant. Working perfectly. We took 54 damage in that, that's all? Yo, that's awesome. Into the third floor, have never made it to the third floor yet. Until now. That's, that's the, oh! Oh my gosh. That was a chest, it wasn't, it wasn't just a difficult room, it actually had a chest purpose, so. Team. Let's see. Try to make a, a point to not lose any more HP. Lost room found. Yay. Enhanced. What do we got here? Enhanced airburst. Tempting. Uh, enhanced air burst would give us uh, shockwaves that buffet foes in your path. That sounds great. In fact, no, let's not take it. Not, not quite yet. It's okay. I was really hoping we could run into a room that had uh, enemies since we had our signature ultimate up. But, uh, 204, 204. Oh, I warped myself off. That's classic me. Son of a gun, don't kill yourself in the last level. Killing potions gonna probably be important. Increased lightning damage. Now we know what the battery of Tar Taranis is. That might be incredibly useful. Let's pick this up for now. 108. Oh man, Mystic. I, I don't. I think I got Mystic Monopole before. I don't remember what it does though. All right. Um, to the east of the blue portal. Gosh. <laughs> Mage of ultimate power, apparently. Oh, what did this this silver spinning top do? I think it increased our Oh man, I don't remember what it does. Do I dare risk it? Let's risk it. Okay. Makes us slow, but increase the activation speed of Arcana, but curse slow movement speed. So even with movement, we're no longer as carefree as we used to. I may have just doomed us. Look at that. I can hold the button down. This is wrong. Look how fast that attacks. 
Oh my gosh. I'm just at <laughs> the attack speed. The attack speed. Oh, uh, and that has a major cooldown. That has a major cooldown. Oh, okay. Maybe, maybe we'll see. Um. Go. Oh, I already bought the healing potion. Apparently, light damage increase. Yeah, sure. Why not? We'll, we'll increase lightning damage. Better turns increases lightning damage. We're, let's um. Let's go make memories happen. Oh my gosh, don't, don't do that. Oh. Okay, trying to kill myself because I'm too slow. I died. I I shouldn't have taken that curse. I had an amazing run. I had everything going for me, and I took the curse because I thought, for some reason, I thought it was the one that um, slowed me down a little bit, but gave me faster attacking. Um, not the one that slowed me down drastically, but gave me arcana increase. And that's, I mean, unfortunately, that just comes with inexperience of the game. However, the, the fun thing is, is there was, so even though this is fairly instant of a, a basic attack, the reducing my cooldowns and stuff did have an effect because I could just hold the button and it was going off. Now I actually do have to press it again. So let's go see what we can upgrade or bring into the round instead. Water Prison, that looks fun. That's an enhanced version of Frost Fan. Breaking Twister signature maybe? Maybe. I think it might be. Yeah, it's one of these. Um. Mm -hmm. What's it, what did it actually say? I missed out on that. Uh, at least a slow moving burst of air that slows and damages all nearby targets. Uh, enhanced Twister stops shortly after being unleashed but continues to spin in place. So the enhanced version just stands there, so it becomes a really high damage AoE in a way. I actually really dig that. And then it gives you the slow on top of it. I wonder if that would be worthwhile to mix the two together, because you could do uh, this and then that, and just really pile it on. Maybe let's... Are we actually running out of... these? You know what, since we did so well, let's treat, us our, treat ourselves to a new robe. Um, grit, vigor, pace. Pace, figure. Um, I have a blue robe. Let's go for pace is probably slower speed, higher thing. I, I don't know. I have no idea. Let's, let's go for brown. Brown it is. Don't know what it does, but we'll take it. Dragon dive. Water prison. Oh, there... There's my cyclone boomerang right there. I see you. What do we get? What do we got? So the two basics are those that don't give any bonuses whatsoever, but we got grit, increases armor, increases defense. So those are just passive increases. I should have been buying these a long time ago. I think I really like this one spell, the uh, the air one. Yeah, so especially if later on it just twists in place, it actually goes quite a ways until it hits a solid object. Does it die if you hit a solid object? Yes, it dies if it hits a solid object right away. So this might be great for hitting enemies and then uh, shooting with this and then launching this in and I just follow the two together. What do you, th what do you guys think? Think that'll be a good combination? Especially if I have 
ultimate up, then I could... Yeah, they could just... That could be devastating. Alrighty, everyone. Thanks for joining me. Thanks for hanging out. For more news and information on what's going on and what may be, check out the description below. If you like what you saw and want to see more, like it, slap the like button. Slap the like button. Slap the like button. Slap the like button. Bash the subscribe button and share the video. This is Dustman Avenger signing off for now. Until next time, Underground. Bye.